If you've just installed Tempo Planner for Jira Cloud, this video is a good place to start. Setting up the basics for Tempo Planner takes just a bit of your time, and you can do it in five steps. I'll walk you through these steps as I set up Tempo Planner for my company called Lunar Industries, which does helium-3 mining and research on the moon. We use Tempo Planner to plan out and staff the many different projects we have on the go, mostly for our product, development, and IT teams. So let's jump right in. The first thing that I need to have is the JIRA Administrator permission. And this is in the JIRA settings under System and Global Permissions. If you install Tempo Planner, you're probably already a JIRA admin, so that's an easy win. Next, I need to give the employees at Lunar Industries access to Tempo Planner. And this is also done in the JIRA Global Permissions. Tempo inserts its own permissions here, so I just scroll down and find the Tempo Planner access permission. By default, Tempo Planner is available for all JIRA users here at Lunar Industries. But to start off, we want only a few stakeholders to try it out first, before we roll it out to the rest of the employees who will be using it. So I've already created a JIRA group called Lunar Tempo Users that contains only these stakeholders. I'll go down to the Grant Permission area and select the Tempo Planner Access Permission from this list. And I'll add my Lunar Tempo Users group to this permission. It's generally good practice to set up JIRA groups for the different levels of permissions needed for using Tempo Planner. And groups make it easy for me to manage access because I can add or remove people from a single group. There's no need to deal with granting permissions to individuals as things change. And while I'm here, I'll grant two of Tempo's administrative permissions to certain small groups. Tempo administrators can do things like create workload and holiday schemes, configure internal issues, and other stuff to manage Tempo Planner. For this permission, I've created another JIRA user group called Lunar Tempo Admins, which contains only a few employees here who should have these administrative powers. So I'll add that group to this permission. Tempo team administrators can create Tempo teams and grant team permissions and also assign team leads for each team. These leads can then manage and edit their own team, including setting their team's permissions. I want to hand off these duties to this group called Lunar Tempo Team Admins, and it includes employees from Human Resources who will create teams for the different departments at Lunar Industries. It also contains project managers who will create teams for their own projects. Now I need to grant the all-important Browse Projects permission to all Tempo users here at Lunar Industries. This is a basic JIRA project permission that lets users see all the JIRA projects that use a certain permission scheme. So I'll scroll up and click Permission Schemes here. And I'll focus on the default permission scheme that we use for most of our JIRA projects. And then click Edit beside Browse Projects. I'll check Group and then select the Lunar Tempo Users group and click Grant. It's always good to check that employees have this permission, otherwise they can't access the JIRA projects that they need to work on. The final thing I need to do is set up for plan approvals. Approvals are optional, but they do give more control and visibility over plan time. I'll go to the Tempo settings and select Planning Time. And then check Enable Plan Approval. I'll also check the Start and End Time option to let employees create plans within a certain time frame. If you're also using Tempo Timesheets, it's useful to have a time frame for plans when using the Calendar View in My Work and the Activity Feed, which tracks your time automatically. And that's it! I've completed the basic steps for setting up Tempo Planner for Lunar Industries. Now to complete the full Tempo Planner setup, there are a few more tasks that need to be done, including setting up the Tempo teams, 
creating workload and holiday schemes to know the working capacity of each employee, and creating internal issues to let employees plan their vacations and other time off, or plan time for company meetings, training, or other events. Now the product managers and developer team leads here at Lunar Industries can test out Tempo Planner by planning work for their teams. After they've given the green light to use it, I'll simply add all the other employees who need to use Tempo Planner to the Lunar Tempo Users Group, and then they can view their plans and plan their own time. <laughs>